I dug this wood panel out of the attic here of the garage. I have no clue what it is, uh, but I think it's going to work for my seat. Uh, hope the customer doesn't mind. <laughs> I'm sure she won't. It's, look, it's covered with so much dust, it looked like it had been up there for a hundred years. Okay, I've made this piece which is going to be my base for my seat springs. It's going to sit in my seat frame and it's glued and um, stapled together. Uh, I would have liked to have made it out of that plywood right there, but there's not enough plywood there. So I just pulled a piece down from the attic and uh, disassembled it and uh, uh, used uh, components out of it. Uh, it was a little bit slower. Uh, sometimes that's how it goes. I just using what we got uh, and um, uh, just keep moving here. So that's how we did this so that we could just keep on going on the project. Uh, I've also added metal and onto this seat frame here, making this frame with these supports here and these here, which this wood lays across in this direction. Uh, it's got to be strong because uh, it's got to goes in here like this and it has to be strong because uh, one of the people that's going to be driving this car weighs about 250 pounds so and that's how that's going to sit in there I'm going to take the door here put it on the body here you can see where I've prepped this we're going to put the door on here that way we can know our fit here and we'll put the seat frame in because it's integral with this body inner structure and start building this body inner structure. So that's what we're going to do today.